What's going on, everybody? Z here. Welcome back to some more Grounded. So, last episode, well, we did some things. We did some stuff. We got some new tools. We got some upgrades. We got a whole bunch. We got a whole bunch of things. I mean, let's let's face it. We got a whole bunch of things. So, um, well, things have happened since uh, <laughs> since that episode, and you can see we have a super amazing base coming along. Look at this thing. Look at this thing. It's absolutely super amazing. So, I'm just gonna do a quick run through. Um, the base isn't done yet. It's not done, but we're in the process of making it. We were doing some live streaming. So, uh, if you want to catch some live streaming action, head over to twitch.tv slash gaming. Anyways, we've got a base and you'll notice like, okay, so well, I don't even think this is, <laughs> it's not even finished yet. Uh, so we have like a little food area. We have a little crafting area right here, trying to get some, uh, chests sorted. Now you can customize markers and things like that, um, to kind of have like, uh, an idea where things are at. And then over here, we're going to have armor, which actually... I think I actually need another dummy now because we're going to go and grab that B armor because literally there's been 60 bajillion comments about the B armor. I was live streaming B armor. So we're going to go grab that. Uh, if you guys don't know where it's at, then uh, yeah, you'll be, be sticking around, hanging out, having a good time. Um, so let's go ahead. Let's put away our spider armor just because I don't need it right now. So we're going to go ahead and, and uh, store that, store that and store that. And the reason I want to store it is because if you go in, oh, that's right. This is, I forgot. These are chests that we were using for multiplayer things. Uh, they'll get fixed. Anyways, uh, I want to go ahead and take these because if you go in ant armor, the ants will actually leave you alone. There's some ants that we're going to, uh, we're going to go check out and they'll actually leave you alone, which is super amazing. It's really nice. Very nice things. Uh, let's go ahead and put this stuff away as well. And then we're going on that. We're going on that. Okay, cool. So we're going to start off getting some B armor, but more importantly, I think there's an upgrade trip, uh, an upgrade chip that might allow us to unlock more things uh, through burgle. So we're going to be doing that. But as always, if you guys enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a like. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe as well for some more. I need a torch. I need a torch before we head out because it's dark in there. It is super dark and super scary, you know? All right, let's do it. Let's go for it. So the um, the area we're gonna go to, it should be right, uh, it's like right here somewhere. It's, it's over here, it's over here-ish. So we're gonna run over that way. We're gonna head over there. We're gonna jump into this gigantic, uh, this gigantic ant hive thing. But since we have our gear on, because we have the human ant, uh, little perk right there. The ants won't actually attack. It's a soldier ants. So it's super nice. You can just walk right through. You don't have to worry about anything. There should nothing, not be anything crazy. And uh, we're going to go grab uh, the bee armor. So I will see you once we get over here. And then I'll mark it on the map too. So you guys can actually see it. All right. So this is the first field station that you come to when you come out of the game the first time. That's where that's at. It's pretty much straight over here from it. Um, so actually, it's like right up here. So there's this huge ant hill right here. And inside of a said anthill, there are some uh, some bee clothing. There's some there's some rotten bee parts, and that's what we're gonna go in after. And I know where they're at, so this should not take very long to do. And like I said, if you have ant armor, which I highly recommend because there's a lot of soldier ants in here that you would end up fighting, um, then you walk right past them. Like this guy, he's not even gonna bother me. Like I just I just boop. What's up, guys? Yo, oh, I know you guys are awesome, right? I know ants are ants. We're doing the ant things. All right, so uh, we're going to head this way first. Okay, uh, excuse me. Sorry, sorry, excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. I'm going to keep you guys here with me so you guys can uh, find the stuff if you want to follow along. <gasps> Ooh, science -y points. Okay, so the first one is in this room uh, that had the science points up here and rotten bee face mask. I know, my gosh. There's one. Uh, second one is going to be, we're going to continue going this way. I'm trying to do this quick because I, I used torches that were already like burnt out. <laughs> so uh, doing what I can with what I got here. Uh, watch out for this hole because there's uh, there's another one right over here that we're going to need to get to. What's up, guys? What's up? But you see how many ants are in here? Like there's there's a ton of ants. Uh, B shin guards. Heck yes. Sorry, guys. Uh, I'll grab some more science because science. Yes. And then we're going to drop down in this hole and whoop like that. And check this out. This is what I'm actually excited about. Is this Ant Hill Burgle chip right there? That is what I'm looking forward to. So we're gonna be checking that out. Ant Hill Burgle chip. Yes, please. Okay, and then the last one is gonna be. Hold on. Hold on. I'm turned around. No, yeah, it's in here. It should be in here. Wait, isn't this where I fell in? 
Yeah, I fell in right here. Oh, it's right here. It's right here. It's right here. Okay. Okay, cool. And shoulder pads. We have the full B armor. The full B armor indeed. Now we're going to roll out. Because I don't want my torch to go. Oh, shoot. It's about to go out. All right. This is, this is going to be uh, this is gonna be fun. Uh, I think I can get out of here. I think I can get out of here. We can do this. All right. I lost my light. I'm hoping that I know how to get out of here. <laughs> uh, I think I need to go this way. I'm hoping I need to go this way. And then I think I need to go up this way. When in doubt, just go up, you know? Just go up. Wait, can I pick one of these? And can I equip that? That would be nice. Can I can I equip you? Like, can I put you here? And then hit seven? No, that <laughs> doesn't do anything. Wait, can I put it in my offhand? Uh, weekend? Oh, come on! It should be able to let me pull that out and just carry it. Okay, perfect. We made it to the surface. <gasps> Wonderful! All right, we did it. We did it! Okay, so now I'm going to head back to the base. So this is where the ant hill's at. Let me pull up the map right here. So now you guys can see uh, ant hill location right there. Actually, let me see if I can throw a flag down too. Um, do we have uh, the stuff for marker? Plant fiber? Oh, we can totally do that. Okay. Let's build everything. Plant fiber. I need one piece of plant fiber. How is there no plant fiber over here? There's some plant fiber. Okay. Perfect. We're good. We're good. We got a flag. We had to mark out this area. All right, perfect. And then let's set our custom marker. We'll go ahead and put an ant and we'll put um, green. Cool. Now we know ant hill right there. Awesome. All right, back to base. Let's sleep. Let's check out the bee armor. But more importantly, the one thing that I want to check out is that upgrade chip. I want to know what can we unlock with it? Holy spiders. Okay, I'm not trying to find any spiders. I could find the spiders if I wanted to, but I'm not trying to find it right now. I just want to get back. I want to make sure the bee armor's safe and we're good to go. You know what I mean? You know, I'm actually curious if these mints ever respawn. And uh, mainly because Miss Z had some issues with her one of her chests. And it ate like half her mints. <laughs> it just, she put them in the chest and they just disappeared. So I'm curious if those ever respawn. Leave a comment down below if you, if you guys have ever had those mints respawn for you. And we're back at home. We're back at base. Check it. I love this base. So I actually didn't even give you a full tour. But we have a downstairs. Um, This is probably going to be for storage. We're going to be storing lots of things. Uh, I got to finish that wall. I can't do that wall right now because we have the dew collectors up there. Uh, but then we have... Uh, there's going to be uh, these little three sleepy deals. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and set my spawn point here. Uh, and then we're going to have a chest in front of each one. And that's for like multiplayer stuff. So like when other people join my game, they can drop their stuff off in a chest, you know, whatever. Bada bing, bada boom. And then up here is a whole nother floor for whatever we whatever we deem necessary, I guess. Uh, and then out here on top of this patio area, uh, we're going to have the, uh, the fungal things. We're going to have some drying racks. We actually already have one drying rack rack right now which is kind of nice uh the dew collectors and then we have the top story top level right here um i think we're gonna put the basketball hoops up here and we might even throw one of the bounce pads up here too just for funsies so yeah this is uh it's, she's a, she's a good size base she's a good size base i'm super excited to see what they uh what what they are gonna add that i can add to it all right so first things first it's morning let's go ahead let's put our b armor on look at that that is pretty neat. Now, it looks like it gives us, are we faster? Not really. And there's no side effects for it right now, but it is rotten. That's level one, that's a level two. So hold on here, let's let's actually take a quick peek here. What do we actually look like here? Let's go into free cam it. I mean, it's pretty neato. It like has like the little fluffs. Like, because bees are super fuzzy, right? I guess. <laughs> I have no idea. I have no idea. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and put this on here. Let's equip all those there. Oh, <gasps> look at that. Oh, it's so good. I'm trying to have a mannequin for each armor set. Uh, so we can have all the armor sets. Look at that. We got the, uh, the ladybug set right there. How cool is that? We got the bee set. We got a spider set right here. Oh, I love it. I love it. Actually, you know what? Speaking of, oh, and let's put our uh, ant stuff away as well, because I don't need this. So right now, my favorite set, and I'm, I'm going to say arguably the best set, is the the spider stuff. I would say that the spider stuff is probably the best set um, because it makes you run faster. You move faster. It has decent defense. Like, I can run and move so much faster now. It's fantastic. Oh, look at that. Oh, I love our armor stands filling up. I need to finish the acorn. Um, I also need to do... Oh, gosh. We have... I need more. Uh-oh. I think we have a friend. Where's my friend? 
Oh, it's just a uh, yeah, it's just an orb weaver. Okay, no worries. No worries. Okay. Now for the time we've all been waiting for, we are going to go and we're gonna put that new chip in and we're gonna see what upgrades we get. Oh, I have no idea. I don't even know what to expect right now. I'm just super excited. I'm super excited about this. Like, oh come on, give me give me some fun stuff to play with. Some new things. <laughs> give me a zip line or a teleporter. <laughs> I doubt. It. Maybe I doubt it. Hey Burgle, I got a chip for you. I've got a chip. Um, I found a burgle chip. Oh yes. Continue. Okay. Trade. Continue. What? An upgrade for the scab bee scanner module that allows it to detect other near scab bees that are not currently attached to a human host. An eye patch. An upgrade for the eye patch that allows it to reduce the stamina cost for attacks. What? Fiber bandage efficiency it refines the fiber bandage recipe so it uses much less ingredients per bandage. Canteen upgrade upgrades the canteen recipe so it can hold more liquid. Oh my gosh, these are amazing! Um, do I have enough to buy all of them? I think so. I should be able to have enough to buy all of them. Let's do it. Let's okay. Bye. No, I'm so close. <laughs> I'm so close. You expanded Burgle's swap shop. Ant Hill chip unlocks. Okay. Uh, so we're 2000. So I'm like 40 short. Oh man. We got the canteen plus. Do I have anything I can research? <laughs> oh man. You know what's so funny is we got those, uh, we got those 15,000 extra points. And I'm, I'm, I'm once again going to need more science points. Oh my gosh, this is insane. It's crazy how many science points you're going to need for this stuff. Um, and I don't think anything respawns either. So, oh, we're going to have to play a lot of multiplayer. Because I think every time uh, somebody joins your game, you get like you get like 50 or 500 points or something like that. So, uh, not positive. But I only need 40 more. Hmm. I wonder if there's anything I can research back at my base. Oh, now I'm super curious. So, what's the uh, what's the cost for a bandage now? Um, let's see. Fiber bandage, one plant fiber, one sap. I want to say it was two. Wait, hold on a second. Wait, what? Whether it's for an injury strategy or just plain fashion, the eye patch will do the job. Plus attack speed, plus attack stamina. Interesting. Why is there there's a hidden thing? Have I not like is that a researchable item? Hold on, we gotta grab we gotta grab some stuff to do some things. Okay, I crafted five. Uh, are bandages just something that can be researched? No. Uh, heals and then plus regeneration. Okay, so, I mean, those are always handy. Okay, interesting. There's so, hold on. There's a recipe I don't know yet. What have I not scanned? I have no idea what I have not scanned. Oh! Pollen is not analyzed. Wait, acorn bits i don't think i can i don't think i can research acorn bits can i really hold on a second okay acorn bits acorn top i think we already did the acorn top no i can't research that can i really well let's go grab some pollen too so if you guys didn't know pollen is actually right over here um we're gonna we're gonna destroy this spider real quick though Okay, we, we're going to. Yeah, uh-uh. No, sir. Go for it. Go for it, man. Go for it. You're gonna be dead. And you're dead. Wonderful. Good job. I told you. I told you not to do it. And still did it. Okay, hold on. Let's grab the pollen. Uh, So pollen is this little teeny tiny yellow stuff that's laying on the ground right here. I don't know that I've actually, I don't know if I've ever actually collected this stuff. So I don't know what it's for. Uh, well, does it give me the little red dot to research? It doesn't. So normally if you can analyze something, there's a little red dot next to it. So we're going to go try to analyze it anyways. All right. Can I analyze either of these? No, it, I, I can't. Invalid object. Okay. So you can't analyze everything. All right. That's fine. That's fine. I was hoping you could. Um, also, it looks like there's some science points nearby. I, it's this way can i get in here i can't get in here must be like up top or something it's weird my little scanner's going off saying that there's like science points nearby 
Wait, can we analyze the B armor? I don't think so. It says the Rotten Ant Club was analyzed, but can we analyze the B armor? Let's check this out now. My gosh. I need to know. B armor? New no, invalid objects. Okay. All right. Well, we had to try. Interesting. Very, very interesting. All right. Well, we gotta we gotta build a canteen plus. We gotta figure out how to craft this uh, this canteen plus here. Um, let's see. It's gonna be in here. Uh, woven fiber grub hide. Ugh, I don't have any grub hide. You know, I'm gonna have to go out and get grub hide. Let's just let's just go out and get some. Let's go find some. There's always some running around over here. Let's just grab them and go. Oh, look at that. We got a whole bunch of larva coming in here. Okay, come on, boys. Come on, let's bring it on. You're going down. Oh, let's try it. No. Oh, we'll, we'll get... We'll multi-hit here. I got a whole bunch of you at once. Holy moly. Okay, there's there's a few. There's a few. Things could get spicy. Okay, things are already spicy. Okay. Okay, go down. Yes, there we go. We got some squashage. Oh jeez, how many are there? Okay, we're gonna we're gonna run over here. We're gonna use uh, some bandies. Okay, looking good. That guy's gone. You know those bandies are actually quite nice. I gotta say. Oh, is that everybody? Is that all of them? You get over here. You're gone too. Any more? Oh, you want you want some? Get back here. You get your larva butt back here. Oh, he's bailing. That guy totally just dipped out. Uh-oh. Oh, there's more. Okay. Were you guys playing dead? I think they were playing dead. Are we good? Are we good now? Anybody else want to appease me? Anybody else? No? No takers? Nobody? Oh, hello. Where are you guys coming from? I feel like they're like endless. Where are you coming from? Oh, hello. Is there like a larval nest over here somewhere? Because this is where I was. <gasps> oh. Oh, hello there. Whoa, huh. What's in here? Well, now I'm curious. Oh, now I'm super curious. Oh, I don't have a, I don't have a, I don't have a, a light. Uh, torch plus. What do you that? Woven fiber and dry grass. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Oh, there's more. What's up, dude? Man, if I ever need any larva, anything, I will be good to go. All right, we're gonna go take a peek down here. I wanna see what's down here. I mean, I already killed like a whole bunch of lava, larva. Oh, there's a grub. I need you actually. But I think a shovel's two-handed. Oh, I got him. Got him. Nice. Uh, I can't see anything. Ooh. Where are we? Where is this place? Ooh, oh, I have my mint mallet, so I should be good. Okay. You don't give off a lot of light, do you? Oh, ho, ho, ho! we're busting through and we're getting quartzite in the process. Heck yeah, I'll take that. Uh, winner, winner. Oh, inventory's full? Shoot. Uh, drop. Okay, we should be good. Quartzite, heck yes. I'll take those. My problem is if I run into more larvas down here, I'm gonna need my uh I'm gonna need my trusty at my my mint mallet. Uh quartzite, quartzite. Yes! Alright, so what do we got? Uh Oh! <gasps> Ooh, more science points. That's exactly what I need. And it's 500! Heck yes it is! <gasps> we got personal log. I have isolated the oh. source of the particle irregularities. They appear to be a byproduct of the shrinking process. If I adjust the machine to account for their existence, it should be the key to the de-shrinking, uh, expanding process. Burgle, oh. please bring up the readings for the irregular covalent SNPI 42Z particle traces. Ugh, that name is going to get tiresome. We're gonna call. While you're at it, rename all references to the irregular covalent SNPI 42Z particle to raw science. <laughs> Order received. Raw science identified. Does it require cooking, cooking flipping, or grilling? No, 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 none of those. Categorization. That answer is not permitted. According to health code oh, standards, man, that's hilarious. 
Oh, uh, we got a new log. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm sorry. I have a lot of stuff. I need to get rid of something here. Let's uh, let's drop those, and let's grab these granola bars. Heck yes, I'll take those. Delicious, delicious. Uh, we don't have anything to analyze right now, do we? No. Okay. Now, let's take a peek around, see if there's any. Ooh, that probably that way probably goes out. And actually, if I'm not mistaken, I think I don't know how a torch works underwater. I'm not gonna ask questions though. Oh yeah, this is the area that we were. Oh oh, we got a scab B. Oh gun metal. Oh hey oh shoot, oxygen, oxygen. Okay. Uh oh, under attack, under attack. Holy running fast. What's attacking me right now? Oh I hear a lot of scurrying about. Lots of scuttling. Okay, we need to go back in there. We gotta explore more. Maybe maybe there's something else in here. Okay, nothing here. No pieces of anything. Nothing laying on top of anything. Chair, desk. Nothing. Nothing, nothing in there. Okay, alright, alright. We got the gunmetal scab. Let's let's roll out. I think that's everything. I didn't I didn't see anything else in here. Uh hold on. I wanna do one more check. Just to be safe. I gotta do we gotta do one more check. Because sometimes there's things in bags and it blends in very well with the little dirts. Uh, I'm not seeing any though. Yeah, I don't see anything else. Okay, we got the scab. We got the gunmetal one. Let's check that guy out. Uh, OS, gunmetal. <gasps> Ooh, I like that one. Okay, we're gonna roll with that. I like that one. That one's nice. Very nice. Okay, uh, and then that way probably leads outwards. It probably just leads out a different hole maybe oh oh yeah okay huh oh this is where the um is this where the uh oh this is where the that bombardier beetle was that we had to kill actually how's it not respawned yet i have no idea awesome okay we got a new gunmetal scab that's super cool all right, let's head back to our base. It's getting dark. It's getting spooky. All right, we're back. I got everything put away for the most part. Um, ooh, I wanted to make the Canteen Plus, but I think I need three grub hide, and I don't think I have it. What, how many did I get? I got one grub hide. So I need to go out grub hunting if I want to use the Canteen uh, Plus, which I, I probably should. And it looks like it actually just replaces the uh, the regular Canteen, so it doesn't look like you can make the regular Canteen anymore. It looks like you just have to make the uh, the Canteen Plus, which is super nice. I like it. I'm curious what these are, though. So we're going to have to go out and we're going to have to do some more exploration stuff to see if we can find some more Burgle Chips somewhere. So uh, if you guys have any recommendations of where other Burgle Chips might be, if you've seen them, leave a comment down below. Super curious, but we might just have to go out and explore and do the things, do the stuff. Uh, also, I really i am digging this gunmetal, uh, this, this new gunmetal skin. Like, that's super nice as well. I love it. And with that, we're going to end the episode. So hopefully you had a fantastic day. Hopefully you had a fantastic time. If you did, please don't forget to leave a like. If you're new, don't forget to subscribe as well for some more. And uh, I'll see you in the next episode.